Well, a couple of long awaited big reveals for two high schools today. LaFleur High School, though, becoming the first to cut that ribbon on a brand new campus stadium. And our Stephen Moody was there. Let's go. One. It's a big day for Rattler Nation. Rattler Stadium at LaFleur High School is officially open. And the atmosphere on campus was incredible. It's, it's an exciting time for the, the students here at LaFleur. We're, we want them to be the very best, and that's why we wanted to have a stadium on our campus. Not only will it provide all the financial support that is needed, but it, it will set a tone for the community. Man, our reaction was sheer uh, overjoyed. Like I said, uh, it's been a, a, a tedious process to prepare without having to feel. So the moment we saw it um, look close to complete, we were extremely excited. It's been nearly two years since the Mobile County Public School System announced several new stadiums, and the outcome is better than anyone expected. The stadiums feature seating for the home and visiting teams, and they will all have artificial turf fields with their school's name in the end zones and logo on the 50-yard line. All of this brings a sense of pride to current and former students. Mr. Brown, TV production, how many times have he recorded me doing pep rallies in the gym? Now he can come back home and record his school, his alumni doing the same thing for football games. So we have so many people that are excited about this that's, that are alumni that we can't ask, but it has been a blessing. And it won't take long for the football team to use it. This Saturday, the Rattlers officially kick off here for the first time with a spring football game. We'll host the first game ever in this stadium this Saturday against Blunt at 530 for the spring. It should be an electric um, atmosphere. Those two teams had a long-standing rivalry, so we're excited to get it going this Saturday. Stephen Moody, Fox 10 News.